Hey guys, welcome back to the Simple Ground Homestead. The sun's going down and we might have a little bit of rain. We're going to try to get this video done before that happens. I've got here what is supposed to be a really cool knife. And I also have a really big announcement. We'll try to get them both together in the same video. Let's see if we can contain it all here, right? Let's open the box. So. I uh, was looking at Amazon the other day and there was a great deal on what's known as a Mora knife. Now believe it or not, I had only kind of heard of these. A good friend of mine um, ordered one once, but other than that I hadn't really heard of them. Come to find out, they're a pretty big thing in the world. So uh, wow look at that pretty thing. Nothing fancy there. So I decided to buy one of them and see how it turned out. Look at this. So I got the Mora Knife Pro Stainless. Believe it or not, I expected to get a different knife, I think. I thought I got the one that was regular old carbon steel. Well, let's open her up and see what she looks like, huh? Set the box down. Shouldn't have set my box cutter down. Oops. Need a knife to open a knife. Well. <clears throat> well, this is pretty nice. Look at this guy. Sticker on the back, made in Sweden, Mora Knife Pro S. In and out pretty well. Got a clip on there. I was a little worried about the case. Uh, I haven't really carried a fixed blade knife other than old school ones. A little clip on there. They want to fall out otherwise. But that clips in really good and tight. Not too worried about losing it. We'll give her a try, huh? So for Christmas, I'm making everybody in my family a slingshot. I don't have any experience with this. And so this is going to be my test one. And we'll work on testing out this Mora knife with my <laughs> slingshot Y here and see how it works, huh? Well, Pretty nice knife for eight and a half dollars. All right, the sun's going down and it's getting dark. So, time for the announcement, right? <laughs> you better get this done before you can't see me anymore. So, a lot of you have been asking about supporting Simple Ground, the YouTube channel and everything we do here, all right? so. I've been throwing that idea around trying to figure out what I'm going to do with it and um, really quite frankly I was having a hard time with it uh, I'm just some of us have never uh, easily accepted money from other people you know what I mean um, but at the same time there are costs involved with um, producing all this content for free, right? And uh, I, I'm honored that people want to help out. That's the other thing too, you know. It's it's a really big blessing that you guys actually care. So I went ahead and 
created some avenues, right? Some methods for, for this to work. And it's starting to rain, so I better try to do it quick. Um, I've created a Patreon page, right? So take a look at it. I'll try to make an, a note in the top corner of the video for you to click on. Not quite sure if it'll work. Haven't tried it out yet. So if, if you don't see it up there, check the description. It's there for sure, right? So that's an option. There's going to be some exclusive content over there. Um, not very much because I kind of want to keep the playing field even. Uh, I don't want to talk about it too long because I'm running out of time, quite frankly. Actually, we might have to escape. Here comes the rain. <laughs> well, the rain came and it made it really dark really fast. So we've got to finish this with porch light, huh? on my messy porch that I'm still working on cleaning up. So the Patreon thing. Before I got rained out, I was trying to tell you. Um, I've set up a Patreon page. Uh, you can go over there and do the Patreon thing. And if you don't know what that is, Patreon's a place to contribute a monthly amount to support what we do here. And, uh, it's only for the, those of you who really want to do it. Like, seriously guys, don't feel obligated to pay me for what I'm producing. If you like it and you want to contribute, please, I'm not trying to stop you. If you're enjoying it and you can't contribute, just share my videos. That's free, it's not hard to do, okay? So, you know, don't worry about it, is what I'm trying to tell you. This is for the people that have been begging me to create something. Here it is. I'm not going to not going to slow you down anymore. Also noticing that some wind's blowing over. I hope I hope it's not creating fuzz. <laughs> anyway, I should also tell you about Patreon. There's some exclusive content over there, right? I'm going to be trying to make it worth your while. If you're do if you're supporting me on Patreon, I'm going to do a monthly newsletter with some updates, uh, do that kind of thing. So it's there, all right? Uh, give you a little bit of something. But say Patreon's not your style, or you want to give a one-time donation, right? Uh, I've also set up a PayPal link. It's for those of you who, who want to support me, but they can only do kind of a one-time deal. or you know, say I might have a project coming up, you want to contribute to that particular project, one-time deal. It's easy, you don't even have to be a PayPal member. Follow that link through, it's a safe link, and the money will go directly into my account. And I'll use it for the channel. It's, it's the way it'll go. There's also what I've been using a little bit here and there so far, my Am Amazon affiliate link. I'm not technically supposed to announce that on YouTube, so I'm not going to give you the official announcement, right? If you follow the link over to my website, I explain it a little bit better there. And really guys, if you do a lot of shopping on Amazon, and you like my channel, and you want to support me, that's a really good way to do it. Hopefully Amazon doesn't get upset at me for saying it that way. And then. For those of you who don't feel like they can support or uh, contribute anything, don't, like I said before, don't feel bad. Go ahead and share my stuff, right? That's what's going to help me the most, is if anything's good enough to share, and you share it with your friends, and they come along, man, that's going to help me out a ton. So there you have it. If you like Simple Ground, you want me to keep going, you can support me. Isn't that cool? You know, I'm saying that from the other side. For me, it's kind of weird. But you've already told me you want to you wanna have it happen, so I'm going to do my best so it, it can happen, right? I've done it. Here it is. It's launched. If anything seems weird or you have any questions, uh, ask me about it. You can ask me about it in the comments here. You can send me an email. Uh, do any of that type of stuff. If you're over on Patreon, you can talk to me there. Any of my social media sites, 
just ask me about it and I'll do my best to answer it, right? We're trying to figure this out together. I don't know how much of this I'll keep in the video. The video is already long. Um, but, you know, it's a, it's a chubby little knife. But it's getting right in there. It's actually nice for carving. Most of my carving experience has been, <laughs> believe it or not, with a, a fold-out pocket knife. It's kind of nice to have a fixed blade. What? <laughs> but even though it's chubby for that notch, it, the curved uh, blade there just fits right in there. <laughs> I get this odd sensation that I'm uh, peeling this off with a kitchen knife <laughs> with this stainless steel. Kind of got to do this outside. Like I said, this is going to be a Christmas present for my family. Planning on making one for everybody. <laughs> and then maybe we can go out as a family and shoot some rocks. <laughs> so that, I don't know. We, we have an odd sense of entertainment around here. Audrey and I kind of decided that uh, this year we were going to do mostly homemade gifts. Uh, we have a few things that we bought and paid for, especially new clothes and stuff. But um, we just feel like Christmas is too commercial these days. And for our kids to get kind of the joy of giving as well as the joy of receiving a present. Who's not happy to get a present, right? Um, we would kind of do homemade gifts. And so far it's worked really, really well. My son and daughter have loved making gifts for each other and for everybody in the family. Well, I can tell already this is going to be a pretty tall slingshot. I want to adjust that a little bit. But cut it long, then you can cut it shorter later, right? <laughs> So first impressions of this Mora knife, you know, it's sturdy, it's a great knife for the price, it's just first impressions, right? I think I'll wear it on my hip for a while. Uh, I'm not usually a fan of something so uh, bulky on the side of my hip. You know, this plus the sheath is going to be kind of clumsy, I think, but we'll find out. I'll wear it for a few months. and. Uh, We'll see come spring what I think of it. Huh? I'll give you another example. We'll see what uh, some hard homesteading use is on this. See if I can recommend it for a homesteading knife or not. Huh? But first off, uh, if you're looking for a cheap knife, I think they're $14 regular price. Uh, but like I said at the beginning of the video, there's part of me that wonders if they sent me the more expensive knife on accident. We'll find out. Um, but, you know, First impressions are good. And then like I was saying in the middle, all that gibberish and garbage, if you want to support my channel, there's a way to do it now. I'd be very humbled, very honored if you're wanting to do that. And uh, hop on over. You can either check it out on my website to see all the options, or just jump on over to Patreon and see what's over there. See what you like, huh? Anyway guys, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for supporting this channel. Thanks for being there for me. You've done an amazing... It's What I should say is it's just amazing how much support you all give me. Uh, we've been working on the solar stuff, plus all the off-grid stuff. Lots and lots of help in the comments from you guys there. And lots and lots of support building this house. It's just incredible. Audrey and I are, great, are deeply grateful for all of that. And uh, hopefully soon we can give you a good update on what the house looks like inside. Besides messy, right? <laughs> and um, in the meantime, happy holidays, guys. I'll try to have some videos all set up so you won't be missing out either way. Thanks for watching and thanks for taking this journey with us on Simple Ground. Now I tried to 
learn how to pronounce the name in Swedish and no luck. Mora Nif. Mora Anyway. <laughs>